This is FYI on your TV, brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham, and I have got Cooking with Joe. Joe Ann Finley's in the studio. First time to the studio, eh, Joe? Yep. That's right. First Joe, time. Joe's been joining us on Zooms during uh, COVID and everything. So today, you're going to cook with us. What are we making today? Apple crisp. Apple crisp. What have we made before? We've made lasagna. Lasagna. Uh, I think we made meatballs. Meatballs. Yeah, and we, I, you've made, uh, I think it was spaghetti sauce of some spaghetti sort. Spaghetti sauce. And chili. And chili. I think you've made chili too. So today we're, because of fall and it's, uh, the apples are ready to be uh, picked and, and cooked. Yeah. We're going to make apple crisp. Make apple crisp. Now you're going to use your good old crock pot? Yep. That's right. Now you brought a recipe with you. And it, what's really nice about uh, getting on to computers and everything, you can just Google Apple Crisp and you can find a, a nice recipe, right? Yeah, nice recipe. That's right. And that's what you usually do when you find uh, recipes to cook. You like to cook. Yeah, I like to cook. You like to cook. Okay, so what are we going to start with? We're going to start with six small apples peeled, and you've already done that. Yeah, did that. Put it in my crock pot first. Okay. Yep. You've got those all prepared. You, you, you're very organized. We got to say, uh, Kim Kirkby's joining us today. She's in the production room. She's helped you get this all together as well. So yeah. there, we've got six small apples peeled and cut into half-inch slices. So about six cups worth, right? Eh? Okay. And now you have substitute regular sugar with Splenda. Splenda. That's right. That's right. We've told people before you're diabetic, so we try and be careful with the sugar, right? We're here. That's so we've substituted a half a cup of sugar with a quarter cup of Splenda. Blender. So you just pour that on top? Yep, pour on the top. Okay. Pour on the top. Now just wait, do it, hang on a minute, Joe. Let's just place and I better read this. Go ahead. Add the sugar. Yes, add the sugar to your apples. Go oh, ahead. Did, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> yep, you're right. No, no matter. The, no. No, add, add the sugar to your crock pot. And then we're going to coat all the apples up. This is sort of nice too because it gives the apples just a little bit of a, a sweeter taste. Hey, got all the sugar. You got all the sugar? I'll take the garbage. How's that sound? Okay, I'll take, take the, garbage the garbage over here. All right. Okay. And next we've got two tablespoons of flour. You're going to put that in? Yeah, two tablespoons of flour. Two mm -hmm. tablespoons of flour. Right here? Yep. You're going to use your tablespoon. Two tablespoons. Yep. And this will just sort of thicken it all up and everything too. Right you, here. Yep. Sprinkle it all on top. Another one? Uh, no, I think, oh, two tablespoons. Is that a one tablespoon? Yep, two tablespoons. Two tablespoons. Two tablespoons. All right. Looks good. Looks Pardon. good. And now I'll just put this over here. Okay. All right. And you're very organized. You got this all measured out and everything. We need some cinnamon. Cinnamon? All right. I got to go back to the measurements to see how much cinnamon we need. We need one teaspoon. One teaspoon. Now that's a quite the gadget here. Okay. Quite one the gadget. Teeth. You just yeah move it up until oh isn't that something? That's just all in one all one in place. One. Okay. Got a little bit of flour in there. Whoops. Yeah. Whoops. All right. So you need one teaspoon of your cinnamon. Cinnamon. There you go. All right. You're gonna. Cinnamon's always nice too. It's sort of a fall flavor too, eh? Cinnamon rolls, cinnamon bun. Yeah. There you go. Got one. Throw her in. Throw, throw her in. in. That's what's nice about a crock pot too, eh? We always say throw it in. Throw it in. Okay. Now you're just gonna stir up the apples. Just to make sure. Yep. Yeah, make sure everything gets coated up nicely. Looks very good. Now, have you made this recipe before, Joe? No, no I'm not we're, making we're just first time in it all over the place here. We like that. Now, there's going to be a lot of apple crisp here. Are you going to be sharing it with a lot of people? Yeah, sharing with a lot of people. Yeah, yeah. You've uh, got some good friends that you like to take around to your yep. apartment building, and they love when you bring out uh, bring some cooking, I'm sure. Cooking. Yep, yep. So how's yep. that look? How that look good? Looks amazing. Yeah. Okay. Now we've got a mixing bowl here. Okay. okay. So I'll let, ask you to hold on to this, and we'll move your crock pot over here. And now we're going to make the crumble on top. Crumble on the top. And this is almost as good as the apple part, right? So here we've got 
We need half a cup of flour. A half cup? Yep, and actually you had in here half a cup plus two tablespoons, so that must be all the the, the rest of the flour you need just to yeah. get in there, because we took the ta two tablespoons out already. Yeah, two tablespoons. Yeah. Look at you so organized here. I'll take the garbage. Okay. Take half a cup of oats. Half a cup of oats. And put that in there. Getting along real fast. Yes, we are going along pretty fast, aren't we? Oh. It helps when you're this organized. That's good. And we have three quarters of a cup of brown sugar. Three cup of brown sugar. There you go. Look at that. Is, this is the topping we're going to put on top, right? Topping. Yep. And a little bit of salt. Let's see your little doodad there. There, your, your measuring spoon. Okay. We have to go down to a quarter teaspoon. There we go. Okay. Okay, we just need a little bit of salt. A little bit of salt. A quarter yeah. teaspoon. That just sort of gives it a little bit of a different taste in there. There you go. Try that. Okay. All right, now what? Stir it all up. And oh. the butter. Oh, the butter goes on top after. Oh, butter on top. Okay. Yep. And actually, it says ice cream if desired, too. We didn't bring ice cream, did we? <laughs> <laughs> no, ice cream. Oh, you can if you want to. I never thought it. Oh, some people like to put, uh, some people like to put cheese on top. Some people like to put uh, whipped cream, all sorts of stuff. I just like mine plain. Mm. I like to enjoy the taste of the apples and the, and the oat topping. So you had bowling this morning too. Yep, bowling to today. That's right. You're in with, uh, is it a mixed league? On mixed Tuesday? league. Mixed league. Mixed league. That's right. How'd you do this morning? Good. Very good. good. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And you also work at the Brigadoon. Work at the Brigadoon. Yeah, we've mentioned that before. You work at the Brigadoon restaurant. You've been yep. there for over 30 years. 30 years. I know. How yeah. cool is that? That's awesome to be able to say that. Yep. All right. That looks like it's mixed up nice and good. Is that good? I think so. What do you think? I think it looks good. Yeah. And you okay. put that on top. On the top? Yeah, over just here. sprinkle it over on the top. Yeah. And we do like to work in the cro look, cook in a crock pot, don't we? You can make it in the morning, come home at night, and your meals are already made. Yeah. So imagine if you had meatballs already or your lasagna, <laughs> then come home to have uh, apple crisp as well. Look at that. Let's see this. That looks amazing. Look that looks me. amazing. Now, here it is. We have to put the butter on top. Butter on top? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it says half a cup of cold butter. Right here. Yep. And you're just, yep, you're going to take the wrapper off. Just going to put that on top. On top. And then we have to, oh, it doesn't take long to cook either. How long does it cook? It says two hours. Two hours. So you have to, you, you're all the way here in Smith Falls today. Yeah. And uh, we'll have to get you uh, back to Kempville. Yeah. And you'll turn it on for two hours. Two hours. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. That doesn't take long at all. No. No, 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 for sure. And you know, there's different ways you can cook this in a crock pot, or you can cook it in the oven and you have it done in like, a, I did it through the magic of TV. We cooked it as well, eh, Joe? This way. You did it last night with me. That, yeah, let's see that. Yeah. It needs to be cut up in chunks. So we're going to do that after. Uh, we'll cut it up in chunks and we'll put it on top. So. Put it on top. But this is what it looks like if you cook it in the oven. Cook it in the oven. That's what it's going to look like. In when my you, crock pot. In your crock pot. So you're going to put it on for two hours. You don't, have to, you don't have to mix it or anything. You just leave it like that. Leave it like that. And then... Uh, ha add water in it? No, it doesn't say water or anything. No. No, the, the, the apples will start to cook and get nice and juicy. Nice and juicy. That's right. That's right. So, well, I thank you for joining us. What are we going to cook the next time you come? Cook next time I come? Yeah. Here? Sur yeah. Yeah. Surprise me. Okay. Stew. Stew. Let's do a stew. Come back here? Sure. Sure. Okay. Let's get you back here. We can do it this way or we can do it by Zoom. I like having you here. Have me here? Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, Tell Kim, come bring me back here. Well, we'll talk to Kim. 
Yes, your driver. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, thanks, Joe, for coming oh, all the way. Oh, you're going to do the... Oh, we'll the, get a knife from the kitchen here, and we'll cut it all up. We're okay. supposed to cut it up into eight pieces, so we'll eight do that pieces. and put it on top. So okay. we'll do that. You put the lid on, put it in your crock pot, two hours, you got a cr apple crisp. Apple crisp. That's right. That's yeah. right. Anything you want to say before we wrap up? Real good. It's going to be really good. I'm looking yeah. forward to it. That's awesome. Thank you very much for joining us all the way from Kempfel here in our Smith Falls studio. Smith Falls studio. Joanne Finley, Cooking with Joe. Yeah. We got apple crisp. Looking forward to it. See ya. Take a picture on oh, we'll TV. Take, we'll take lots of pictures. <laughs> on TV? Yeah, you'll be on TV.